So pembrolizumab have got approved in MSI high, meaning mismatch repair deficient colorectal cancer. And I think it's one of those breakthrough events in, in the treatment of this disease because um, we know it works. We have seen data uh, from uh, phase one slash extend, expanded uh, phase two studies that uh, a lot of patients have durable responses. There's even the idea that some patients with metastatic disease might even be cured. So there is a uh, strong uh, excitement you know, of, of the oncology community to really embrace these drugs. And um, everyone wants immunotherapy to work for his or her field. So I'm excited to see that uh, pembrolizumab as a PD-1 antibody finally made it uh, to FDA approval in this in a situation where we knew it already worked. And you know, it had already been listed in NCCN guidelines and second and third line treatments together with nivolumab. So the pembrolizumab data came earlier. So I would actually expect nivolumab also to receive approval at some point. Um, so again, we are excited about this. It's, um, it still leaves a lot of patients, 95% of patients, uh, who are not candidates for immunotherapy at this point in time. So that's the next uh, frontier, you know, that we need to find treatment options to make immunotherapy work in these patients who are clearly in unmet need.